Yes. <laughs> My birthday's on a Sunday. Um, hey guys, that was Sheldon. <laughs> um, so yesterday was our Purdue trip. Um, yeah, it was exciting. We left around 9.30 yesterday morning. And we may have gotten lost a couple of times, but we got there. And then we finally found a place to park because Purdue was crazy because it was family weekend. Um, and then we went our separate ways and we all went to go hang out with our friends. And I, hang out, I hung out with Michelle and I didn't get to see Maddie. But um, we, uh, we just hung out and after we got back to, um, one, one of our friends, Emily, had to go home because she was sick. So her dad had to come get her, which was sad. I know. And so, um, oh, we wore our Purdue shirts, the one that says, friends don't let friends go to Purdue. And no one said really anything to us until we went to the Mexican restaurant. And these guys that are sitting behind us must have read them. And they were a little bit intoxicated. So um, the waitress came over, and of course in her Spanish accent, we couldn't really understand her, but she says something about the guys behind us asking about why we didn't let friends go to Purdue, and so they, which I don't understand because they were in the booth right behind us, so they could have just talked to them, us themselves. So then they did, and they asked us why we don't let friends go to Purdue, or where we were from, or why we were there, and we told them we were from Rose Holman, and that, I don't want to seem like we're bragging, but this is what we're going to do. And so we told them that we were the number one engineering school in the country, and then they said, in whose opinion, and we said Newsweeks, because it's true. 14 years in a row, Newsweek has named us the best engineering school in the nation. I, it was, it was funny, but, um, we shut them up, and then they tried, <laughs> they googled Rose on their phones to make sure that we, um, we were telling the truth. And so the whole time, we could hear them talking about it and, like, reading our facts off of the internet, and it was pretty funny. And then, um, as we were checking out of the, or paying for the Mexican food, uh, this guy behind us was like, oh, why wouldn't you let your friends go to Purdue? And then we turned around and he says, oh, Rose Holman. Oh, okay. I, I get you. I didn't know they like girls in there now. And we're like, yeah, we do. Oh, I could probably show you the video of Amanda climbing up the fountain and sliding down it. That was pretty funny. Does anything else exciting happen this week? Uh, don't know. Okay, well, really. uh, we've done a lot of homework, and, oh, our quarter schedules came out, and next quarter I don't have to get up at 8 o'clock every morning, which will be kind of fantastic. Oh, so I'm taking this on my computer because my camera stopped working because the battery ran out again and that was super exciting so it was hard so I decided to just try it on my laptop and I figured out that I can do it on my laptop so this might happen a little bit more often so I don't have to upload it on the computer and stuff like that <laughs> Oh, um, Sheldon's trying to do her hair. She looks pretty 80s today. Earlier when she blow dyed it, it was like poof. And then she looked like she was from the 80s. It was pretty, pretty great. Um, so this week should be another nondescript week. Um, we had, I'm going to Apple Festival next weekend, which should be fun. The thing about Apple Festival that confuses me is the fact that we don't have any apples at the Apple Festival. There's nothing Apple themed, nothing Apple sold, nothing Apple anywhere. Oh, last week I got less than 30 hours of sleep, which will stun you all. But last night I got 11, so it's all good. Um, <laughs> Sheldon's um, yelling at her hair again. Um, alright, well, I'll see you guys next week. <laughs>